Justin. And, ooh, the Roy coming out for Mercs here. Now, this is quite interesting. The Roy for Mercs. This should be a lot of fun. Roy, another one of those fun characters. Uh... Not a brawler like Captain Falcon does have that sword, but can certainly still have those kind of high-octane fun combo plays in a similar fashion. Getting started on off with it, we got some good damage coming out of the gate from the Mercs. He's applying tons of pressure to Squeeze here. Squeeze having a hard time holding up the shield. Already off the stage at 100% here, and no hits landed onto Mercs. Oh, great catch on the landing there from Mercs. He is holding control of this stage. As Squeeze Theorem has such a hard time just getting on in. Off on the ledge again, trying to make it back on. And there we go, a great nair for Squeeze. Gets him some space and starts contesting against Mercs here. Ooh. A little bit of shield play on the center stage there. Squeeze coming on out of it with some up tilts. Going for the knee, but a nice air dodge will get it there. Oh, a good roll from Mercs. Made that side B whiff there. Does not turn it into anything for Mercs here, but... Nonetheless, Squeeze Theorem doing a good job of catching back up onto percent. Has got Mercs onto 100% here. This could go either way. A nice upbeat out of shield. A great parry there from Squeeze. Oh, but a great counter from Mercs in kind. That will be Mercs taking that first stop. And that counter coming on out of nowhere. Completely taking Squeeze's stock there. And now he's going to have to do the best he can, take out Merc's stock as fast as possible, stop this bleeding. Oh, as Merc's just racking up the damage. No two-frame with the neutral B. Squeeze having a tough time, making it onto the stage once again. This ledge presence, oh, and another counter. Gonna have to be careful of these. Good grab, though, comes out from Squeeze. Back throw does not kill quite yet. While going for the spike, we respect it, Squeeze. <laughs> Grab coming out from Mercs here, getting Squeeze off onto the ledge. Nice Nair, though, will make his way back onto the stage. And Squeeze still needs to get rid of this stock. There we go, baiting out the counter. This time playing around it, really great adaptation from Squeeze. Able to recognize that counter and uh, punish it afterwards. Has finally taken out that first stock for Mercs, but 102% on him already. Gonna have to do a lot of work to catch back up in this match. So far, so good. Needs to make it back onto the stage here, not get too frame. Good job there, stalling out the jump. And has made it back onto the stage here. Needs to try to find a grab or some kind of hit. There we go, finds that Nair, the knee not landing. That could have been a crazy combo for him, but... Squeeze doing a good job with these aerials, these falling aerials, starting off some damage, just getting enough stray hits on in that uh, we have evened up the percent. So Squeeze has done exactly what he needs to here. If he can get this kill before Mercs can, this could put him in the driver's seat for the last stock. Oh, unfortunately, though, a great catch from Mercs will grab that first stock. Now Mercs in that driver's seat. And Squeeze needing to even this up and does just that really great stock there. Evening up, going into the last stock here as we are both at zero. Oh, good grab here. This is off on the side. This could get deadly. Nope, not going for any spikes here. As we make it back onto the stage. Both players just trying to throw out some safe options, get some straight hits on in. Squeeze making it back onto the stage. Oh, grab does come down in though. Merck's able to grab on that shield, and now Squeeze in a tough spot, not two frames. Wipe the sweat off his brow for that one. But now, needing to try to catch up on percent here, as Merck's has gotten a lot racked up, and this is a scary spot for Squeeze to be in. Last stock, 100% already. A good grab, though. Could lead in onto something. Oh, great roll from Merck's on that ledge, though. Stopping all of these combos for Squeeze after grabs. Fantastic job here. There we go. Still no tree frame, but oh, a great rollback from Merck's. That will catch it. Nice catch there from Merck, so we'll go ahead and grab that first game. Very close game we had between the two of them, though. Merck's, Merck's, Merck's. We, looks like we have some uh, some Squeeze and some uh, Merck's fans in the chat. Uh, if you go ahead and cheer on your favorite player here, as this is a very close one. I could go either way. We do see Merck's taking that first one, though, so Squeeze will have to win the next one if he wants to take it to another round. Although our... We're not in best of five yet, are we? No. No, yes. We are still in best of three. So, Squeeze Theorem will need to win this one out. Looks like we're going for the run back. 
Roy, Captain Falcon on PS2. We'll see what Squeeze can do on this one. It certainly was a close game. Just uh, we saw Mercs really taking the stocks first and uh, having the advantage in that sense. But we'll see if Squeeze can turn things around, try to adapt to the matchup here. Oh, great parry from there, but no follow-up, unfortunately. Squeeze going on in with the dash attack, trying to find some aerials, but Mark's doing a good job of getting back onto the stage, not letting Squeeze Theorem to get these up airs combos going on. Ooh, good side B, or not side B, up B. Uh, it was rotated, that's why I said side B. Anyway. <laughs> And the hits have been pretty even so far as both players are around this 100% mark. We'll have to be careful of any kill moves coming on out. One needs to be careful of these back airs. Squeeze does make it on stage. Not, no back airs to worry about. Now Squeeze looking for his own. Goes down for the knee. Does not land, but grabs an up air on the way back. Oh, a good spot dodge onto that grab. Incredible from Mercs there. And will grab that first stock. Now going on in for as much extra credit as he wants. Already 34% in counting. Squeeze needing to start getting rid of this stock from Mercs. 159 will finally take it. Not too bad of extra credit here. Only 34%. This is very easily can catch back on up. And with a double grab like this, Squeeze is done just that. Another grab as well. Getting him off stage. No spike to be found. Squeeze though and Mercs both make it back alive. Oh, Squeeze right back at it. Throwing Mercs off the stage once again. Good spot dodge from them there though. Will allow both players to settle back in center. Ooh, trying to read the roll in there, Mercs. That was a, a hard read going for it, but does not pay off. Grab coming in for Squeeze Theorem here. Looking to try to get these up air combos going on. Mercs makes it back onto the stage, but 133. We'll have to be careful of a kill. Back throw might just kill here. Yes, and it will. Good job from Squeeze there, racking up enough damage for that back throw to kill. Getting sh heavy shield pressure though from Mercs. Finally makes it on out. And now Squeeze is in the driver's seat. We haven't seen this one yet here. It did take the first, or the stock first this time. So we'll see how we can do here. Keep this advantage rolling. So far, so good. As uh, Mercs though, still looking to try to close out the stock. Squeeze at 109%. Can he get the two frame? Not quite. But the uh, tilt will do instead. And this time, going on into the last stock here, Squeeze it does have the advantage with 73% on Mercs already, but Mercs doing exactly what he needs to to even this one back on up. As the damage is racking on up here. Incredible job. Oh, going for that smash attack though there. Does whip as Squeeze trying to punish onto it. Doesn't get the spike he's looking for, but we are back to an even game here. Good grab there from Mercs. Can't be landing that aerial onto the shield. A squeeze is thrown off onto this off the stage here. Could be a dangerous spot to be in. Does make it back, and never mind. As <laughs> Mercs will grab that stock. Really great spacing to land that back air. Oh, I thought I thought Squeeze Theorem was absolutely safe there, but incredible spacing from Mercs. Saboya 